You're watching Fox 5 News at 5. Oh, and this is really special. The show goes on at a certain place. Our visit with some retired showbiz stars living out their golden years all under one roof. So there is a special place in New Jersey where more than a hundred super talented actors and performers are all living under one roof. It just so happens that they are retired and they're living out their golden years in an assisted living nursing facility run just for them by the Actors Fund. Fox has Antoine Lewis pays them a visit. Talking shop can take on a variety of topics, but when the shop is the entertainment industry, talking becomes timeless. The nicest thing was uh, not having to go out in a, or work in an office. 91-year-old Robert Evans is a resident of the Lillian Booth Actors Home in Inglewood, New Jersey, a nursing home where all of the residents are retired showbiz professionals. Bob was a Broadway performer for more than 20 years, appearing in the original productions of Guys and Dolls, The Music Man, and The Pajama Game, starring a very young Shirley MacLaine. Music was has been my life, and dancing gave me one uh, a way to express myself. Skip Lynch appeared in Broadway musicals for two decades, even helping to calm a nervous Lana Turner as she was transitioning from movie to stage actress. How was she to work with? She was great, actually. She was a perfectionist, you know, from that metro training ground. In the 1950s, your show of shows starring Sid Caesar and Imogene Coco was one of television's top variety programs. And 89-year-old Joan Stein was one of the show's pianists. Miss Joan got her big break after endless auditions and was initially bothered by YouTube, turning unknowns into overnight sensations. But I've come to change my mind. There's so much talent out there. And if there's any opportunity for a young person by being on YouTube, Go to it. 124 performers live here, many with no place else to go. A fact not lost on Tony Award honoree Joe Benincasa, CEO of the Actors Fund. I know that if we were not providing the services we do, if we didn't have a home like this, uh, many people would uh, be in terrible circumstances. <laughs> Veteran opera and cabaret performer Larry Woodard joins his best friend, Miss Joan, at the piano. Now, they perform duets like this all the time. Woodard sums up the home's importance to these titans that today's generation of performers owe a huge debt to. In the words of Dr. Phil, it was a soft place to fall. <laughs> Great to land here and to find all these erstwhile colleagues and, um, you know, to keep up the music. From Inglewood, New Jersey, Antoine Lewis, Fox 5 News. <laughs> oh, man, great people. A lot that of is talent really, And there. it's nice that they can all be together because yeah. they understand the life. Yeah, and they're having a good time, obviously, mm -hmm. enjoying it. Terrific.